hey y'all welcome back to my channel during the happiness and for new here welcome to my channel i would love for you to like comment subscribe and hit the notification bell that way you'll be notified every time i upload, upload a new video so i'm going to vlog do like a little work vlog today dating life is a med aid um slash med tech because i'm going to be on a cart today um so i'll show y'all what i can show y'all but um i'm running a little behind and i gotta get some gas so the next time i see y'all i'll be at work so the first thing I do after I clock in, um, I put all of my stuff in the locker room and put it in the locker. So I counted off the narcotics with the first shift med aid. Um, I can't really record me doing that, but um, basically I, I count off the narcotics to make sure that all the narcotics are there that's supposed to be there. And yeah, um, the narcotics are kept in the first drawer right here so this is called a pill crusher um i use this to crush up medication for residents that have swallowing problems um some people just can't swallow pills and this right here is the applesauce when somebody has to have their medicine crushed i normally mix with applesauce but sometimes i can mix it with pudding ice cream yogurt anything like that and it just helps them uh Swallow the medication quicker. That's that's a thickened liquid. So that's for people who are on a thickened liquid diet, meaning they can't have regular liquids. Um, it has to be you know thick so they don't choke. So I'm done with my first med pass right here. I'm just having a little snack, um, some apples and caramel sauce. And I wanted to share y'all this pro stat because every time i give this to somebody or almost every time they complain they say it's disgusting i've never had this before so i don't i've never had to taste it but um there's two residents that get it and they they hate it so um now i'm on my lunch break right here i'm just warming up my food i brought uh some leftover hamburger helper i cooked the night before And uh, I like to take my break in the this little office. Um, we have a restorative CNA. She works during the week. And um, I, I kind of like to be by myself on my break. So that's why it's, it's her office slash a salon. It's also where residents go to get their hair washed or get their hair cut. So, yeah, I like to take my break in here. See, I got the door closed. It's just the break room is really small. And people be coming in there wanting to talk about patience and this and that and I like to just kind of do my own thing and be by myself on my break but I always let the nurse know where I'm at in case like in case she just needs to know but yeah right here I'm just showing y'all my lunch bag and yeah I'm about to eat my food so right here it's time to get started on my evening med pass I started at about 7 30 My first patient, she gets like eight or nine pills. That's me getting the ginger ale for a president that asked for one. And right here, I'm just showing y'all the med room. This is where we keep like um, the extra medicine. So if somebody runs out, or if, if, if I use the last pill or something, I go in here to get another bottle. Um, this is just over the counter stuff right here, like Tylenol, stool softeners, things like that. So one of the last things I had to do was get a lighted, I think it's called a lighted on patch from one of my residents. She gets this every night on her knees. Um, it's a patch to help with pain. And I'm short, so I had to use this little ladder thing or footstool, whatever you call it. And there I am getting the patches. So I'm just putting the date on, on the box. Because whenever you uh, open up a, medi a new medication for the first time, you're supposed to put the date opened um, on it. So that's what I'm doing right here. And I forgot I did have to get somebody's blood pressure. So this is the last thing that I had to do. And I'm just showing y'all uh, this little basket here that the nurses use 
to uh, check got everything that they this has everything that they need to give insulin what the needles and to check uh blood sugars and stuff sometimes i check the blood sugars if there's only one nurse but at this particular facility uh most of the time the nurses get the blood sugars but i can get blood sugar to check the blood sugars as a med aid and this is like about 10 o'clock i'm done with my med pass i'm just having a little snack um, until it's time to go uh, and right here I'm showing y'all like where they keep the cups and the medicine cups because I always stock my cart um, for the next shift you know, that's just common courtesy I make sure the cart has plenty of straws that's those are the spoons right there um, spoons water and stuff like that hey y'all so I'm off work now I'm kind of annoyed um, it's raining hard out here and it's hard for me to see the roads. I hate driving at night in the rain But I'm gonna do the best I can It's like I can't tell what lane I'm in It's so annoying, but um, I had a good day at work um, Let's see nothing really major happened. I had like I want to I was on the uh, rehab side and I had like a uh, 12 patients so I got done with my med pass at like 10 o'clock. Um, I gave out like four PRNs. A couple of patients were asking for pain medicine. One patient asked for cough syrup, PRN cough syrup. Um, overall, it was a pretty good shift. Um, I don't know how much footage I got. You know, it's, it's really, ooh. It's really hard to, um, that was some lightning that just struck. It's really hard to um, film at this job because this is kind of like a smaller nursing home and you know it's like always somebody not always but lots of times somebody around like seeing how you're walking around and I don't want nobody to see me with my phone out but I filmed what I can of course I'm not going to show any patients or any co-workers or anything like that but yeah I'm going to go home now and I will see y'all the next time don't forget to like comment and subscribe bye